What's going on, everybody? It is your boy J to the Air back with another YouTube video. Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I do want to apologize for the big gap from the last video that I posted my CGC submission. As things kind of came unexpectedly and put me in a little bit of a financial bind, but I'm um, getting back on track and I want to provide you guys some content for this month. I know it's already almost the middle, but hey, I'm going to try to at least stick to my word and my plans and give you guys two videos this month before I go on vacation. So first things first, um, I want to say there was some positive out of the time being. Um, I know I got the CGC submission back and I launched my eBay store. I put a little bit more of my serious slabs on eBay. I still have my Macari pages, still stuff up there, but I have now decided to cross platform selling to try to get more viewers and attention to sell this product off. Um, I will link the eBay in the description so just stick around and stay tuned as per usual you know it's always going to be the slab of the video right now what you're looking at is a pokeon collection fletching first edition japanese of course and a psa 9 um i don't think there's others that are graded so this is a low population slab uh the border i got from an order somebody gave me on another psa slab and i just decided to slap that on there it looks cool it's not really color coordinated so when i find another color coordinated slab i'll just slap that one on but anyways let's get right into it so this is a two-part see my fingers two-part pack ripping video I'm going to show you guys what I was able to get my hands on. Uh, disclaimer, this is all Japanese. Um, I'm not really chasing after the American sets right now. I know there's a few out and there's another one coming out. I think it's Shrouded Fates coming out. But um, right now my focus is on capturing Japanese cards. I don't know why. I guess because of the price point, you can't beat them. But I have 10 of these Paradigm Triggers, which I'm only going to open five. Like I said, it's a two-part video. I have... 15 of these cyber judge i'm only going to open seven i have three raw packs of shiny treasures and a booster i'm only going to open these three and last but not least even though i'm not opening it tonight i was excited to get my hands finally on a 151 japanese booster box so stay tuned I'm excited about that booster box because it's, uh, you know, guaranteed there might be a SAR in there, hopefully the Zard, because I have the, the Charmander and Charmeleon, and there's a chance of getting the Master Ball. I'm hoping the Gengar or the Pikachu, you know, double banger for what I paid for. So, you know, I'll go through it as I'm talking through the video, explain to you what's going on, and you know, at the end is always a recap, but let's get this started. So let's pick the five that we're going to go with. I think we're going to go all even. So two, four, six, eight, and ten. So we save these five for the next video. Hopefully, you know, all ten of these are bangers. And since we're doing even, I'm going to do one. I'm going to skip to five, five, seven, nine, skip. One, boom. So I should have a total of eight left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, I have nine. So this one, there we go. I have eight now. Boom. This video is going to be definitely shorter. The part one is going to be shorter than part two. We got a total of 15. We have seven of these, five of these, and three of these. We always leave these for last because there's the most. Um, I think I'm going to open the paradigm first because it's been a while cyber judges always gets their parents so we're going to start with the paradigm first hopefully you know we have something we're just going to mix it around hopefully we start off with a banger all right so i hope everybody's been doing good i know it's been a while i know it's been a very long time but you know We'll figure it out. All right, so Aaron, Snow Run, whatever. All right, so nothing there. These packs be, like I said, they be glued tight. So let's see. Uh, 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 uh. 
Uh, nothing in so far. Nothing good. All right. We're 40% done out of that. Going on the way to 60. Let's see if we could get at least something to put up on that second holder from out of here. If not, there's five more on the other side. Nope. All right, 60% done on our way to 80. So, so far, nothing banger. I think the Lugia is in this set. I don't know, you know, I hope I pull the Lugia. That would definitely make everything worthwhile. All right, so we got a V. Okay, not bad. And we got this. Blast Pack Magic for Paradigm Trigger. I remember when I first pulled my first V, I was like, yo, oh my God, this is so dope. Now, because those, I know what it's worth, it's just like, ah, uh, is that a hollow? Yeah, it's a hollow. All right. So, Paradigm is okay. Sorry. Ooh, sorry for the wobbling. I just like it in this case. So, so far, we got one hollow out of Paradigm. And the rest are just bulk. So, we're going to put you off to the side. Now, we're going to go to Cyber. All right, let's see if Cyber brings us a bit of better luck than Paradigm. Let's see what we got here. Nothing so far. Like I said, the quality of these cards are just beautiful. All right, so we have a hollow, okay, and our first hollow. Like I stated, I feel like the vintage hollows were probably one of the best hollows that they had. Swirls and everything is unmatched. This new hollow pattern is just so corny. I mean, they've been getting better with the sword and shield. I mean, Scarlet and Violet era, but still. All right, another hollow. Cool, cool. So just put you down here. We'll sleeve up the hollow in a second. And we got this in here. So I think I got like what, three packs left. So we're like halfway done. No bangers yet, but still optimistic. Nope, all right, let me sleeve up the hollow. It's gonna be so fun opening up that uh, booster box. I gotta check the website if they are back in stock. Cause I know the store was closed and I was worried that they will sell out before I get mine, but I was able to get one. Uh, I can't really tell those. These these cards are all right. All right, two more packs left. Let's see if we can get a hitter. And then we're just down to the last three raw packs of the shiny treasures. All right, one, two. Uh, nothing, okay. All right, well, last pack magic. This is the things that we run into, folks. When things like this happen. Okay, all right. So we got an AR ending off nice, not bad. Not bad at all. So we're at the last part of the video. We got one AR, so it was a hit per every pack. Still kind of, you know, you know, you wish to have more. I think it's three. It's one, two, three. I believe it's three. All right. So let's see. Shiny Treasures EX is the last one. This takes more sleeves. So we got a hollow, another hollow, a reverse hollow, and the EX. Okay. Not bad. So we'll just go through these. I ain't gonna stop. Just let's finish this out. One, two, three. Sorry, let me just put these on the bottom. Boom. 
Last pack magic. Let's see where we at with it, y'all. Let's talk. There we go. Last pack magic of the night. And then I'll get to talking. One, two, three. A baby shiny and an ex okay not bad not bad at all to end it so guys that is it 15 packs uh nothing super serious i uh, will go over the hitters for those who maybe like to skip through so you got a baby shiny Raiolu, just wiggly tough ex uh terror i believe ex and uh no sorry it's another card it's a glimmit Wiggly Tough, Torterra, AR, I don't know what AR this is. I'm not familiar with the name. I have to look it up. And a V from Paradigm Trigger. Um, these are like realistic pulls, you know what I'm saying? Not everything is gold. Um, still leaves more mystery of what I have left in my uh, box. I mean, that booster box, definitely the Shiny Treasures EX, uh, definitely has to have an SAR in there. So, you know, can't wait to get into that. But let me get more into those. So my recap, um, like I said, it's been a little busy. Um, I just was able to get some packs. Um, I'm going to try to make another video before I go on vacation, hopefully. Um, at the end of the month. If not, then when I get back, even though that would be August, I just had to make a video for this month because I noticed my viewership has gone down. But that's okay, you know. I'm not the super blogging type where I have the cameras rolling. But um, you know, I'm gonna try to do my best to provide contact, get better with that. That was one of my goals for the year. So yeah, I like the shiny treasure ex um packs. Um, I feel like my store has them at a great price right now. They were really expensive uh, a few months ago, like seven dollars a pack. Now they're like four. Um, so that's like almost 40, 50% discount. Um, you know, and also the 151 box was like 161 at a time. Now it was like $60. So it was like, I'm, I'm seeing the trend of it becoming more affordable. I'm not really a big, like follow the trends chase person, unless I'm able to pull a card that's hot, then I'd fall into like, okay, let me see if I can get this card off. But even still, I think the way Pokemon is, is that it's beautiful that it has ups and downs like stocks. Because then now when you buy in, you get the chance of, you know, getting the card that everybody was, you know, it was sought after and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, yeah, you can hit, tell by my voice how enthusiastic I am right now with these pulls. But these are these are realistic pulls. I haven't really pulled anything in a very long time. I haven't been buying product. I've been more so just checking in on my eBay page, letting it settle. Um, my Macari page, I really haven't been tending to it. I made a sale the other day, but right now, like I said, I've just been chilling. I haven't checked out what's going on. I know like the latest pack, this com latest set is coming out of Shrouded Fates, but I haven't really given much energy towards new none of the uh, Scarlet and Violet. Like the only one I really may have given a little bit of my time and finances to was Paradox Rift. But I really couldn't figure out what was the main chase card in that set. I mean, I did like that Pori, uh, that Polygon, Porygon or whichever it is, the uh, AR. But other than that, I really haven't had a chance. I felt like I'd been stuck in a time lapse and there's a new set every week. So that's why I'm just capitalizing on getting these Japanese sets like the 151 and the Shiny Treasure EX before it goes back up in price. Because it will go back up in price. I mean, there's a Charizard in both of these sets. Uh, and... Before you know it, while it being very cheap, cheaper than what I told you, like I said, 161 was when they were selling for the 151 Japanese booster and almost $70 for the shiny treasures. And we're talking about it cut in half. People are going to buy it out. It's going to be sold out and the price is going to be driven up again. So you got to cherish where you can. I'm going to check the store again to see if they restocked. Uh, put it in my cart for now, just for wishful thinking. But um, yeah. Like I said, last but not least, it's not a long video. Um, I'm going to try to do another video before I go on vacay, hopefully. Um, that could be in another, what's today, the 15, another week or so. 
because you know at the end of the month i'm going i would like to go let me you know speak that of positivity so uh, i want to provide you guys at least two videos for this month since i didn't live up to my uh expectations last month but stick around stay tuned please like comment and subscribe i uh, appreciate my subscribers my views i need them to go back up so please just watch ask me anything i'm gonna link the ebay page the makari page as per usual and my instagram page where all my slabs are that i posted i need to update something on there i might update a new slab up there tonight uh just for the sake of it but yeah everybody take it easy until next time later